Hello everybody and welcome to this video of where I will be showing on how to add hair to your avatar in Blender with Cat's plugin and this is a update in regards to my other tutorial on how to do it. Um, I'm also making this tutorial on to not forget and also for those who have been asking me. So the first thing you want to do is you already have your avatar in <laughs> Blender obviously. Um, and normally what I do first is I go to the armature of which uh, the hair is in. Um, and I like to drop down the armature, the one with the little stick man, not this one, but this one. And I like to rename it, um, let's put edge. And then I like to go to my main avatar's armature and rename it. Uh, well, I just put in parentheses here, uh, <laughs> body, to make it more simple. And what you want to do is, um, I will not be showing how to add cats in this video, but um, there is a video on how to add cats, which I will put in the description, because I am only here to explain how to put on hair. Um, you want to open your cats plugin, it'll be right here, and you want to drop down custom model creation. And do not open attach mesh, op only open merge armatures. And normally, I guess for some people, you'll have all of these checked, but in this case, you want to have everything unchecked. And you only want to have merge all bones checked. And you want to have your base as armature body, the one that you had renamed, and to merge edge, or whatever you named your armature to be for your hair. So body, hair, and then you want to go ahead and merge armatures. But before you do that, you want to look inside of your avatar's head. Um, it'll look like this. It'll be a bunch of bones, probably. And you want to find your avatar's um, head uh, bone. So you want to drop down your armature. You want to go spine, chest, neck, head, and you're gonna be clicked on the head and well as we know it there it is there's a head right here this is the head bone if I'm not mistaken let me just check and there it is and then you want to check where your um, hair armature is so your hair armature is right here and the head bone root edge is right here. Now that they're merged, you want to go into edit mode and you want to click on your hair root first and then you want to shift click the head bone and you want to control P, keep offset. And I know it'll say connected right here but that is false, keep offset. And if it doesn't work for you and it doesn't say um, keep offset or maybe it'll have like a crossed out keep offset as I was told, um, you want to retrace your steps because you might have not have actually done something right. And if we go into pose mode, you will grab the head bone and you will move it back and forth and look. Um, I haven't attached the, the hat yet, which is really irrelevant in this case, but your hair is done and that is how you attach hair. This is straight to the point and exactly how I do it. Um, and in fact this is a Nessie hair so yes a follow-up update if you want to keep up to date with me and this avatar look at the link in my description or a discord link for my server and i will see you in the next tutorial